Hey guys, Brian here with another Clash of Clans video, and I am back from Vegas. Um, didn't go too well the last couple days. I actually lost pretty much all the money I won in Oklahoma, but it was worth the experience, and um, I had a good time. Um, I wanted to talk about a couple things today. First off, my new attack strategy. Oh, I messed it up. I don't know if this is going to work. I've been using uh, more Valkyries than I have um, Giants. I don't know why I have 32 Giants. I'm supposed to have 20 Valkyries, so... That's a little bit frustrating. I don't even know if I trained my other Valkyries. Okay, I did not, so... I'm gonna have to get rid of some, though, because I definitely want to get at least two more. So I'm gonna do that really quick while I'm talking. And then the other thing I want to talk about today is... Me and Molt are gonna be starting up our horse series, except to make it a little bit shorter, because the last one ran a little bit long. We are going to be doing a, um... A pig series, so it's gonna be a lot shorter. If you guys don't know what our horse series was... It was a series where you guys got to pick the attacks, and we'd have to challenge each other with those attacks. And you guys can pick whatever composition you want, and if you weren't able to complete it, then you get a letter. And so the first attack, I'm going to challenge him, um, I and then the rest of the attacks you guys will get to pick. Actually, you know what? You guys go ahead and pick right now. Leave a comment in the comments down below saying what troop composition you want Mold to attack with. Um, and what percentage he has to get. Don't, don't be ridiculous. Don't make it impossible. Challenge him, but don't be like, oh, three stars with just barbarians. You guys make it realistic for him. Um, so let me know what you guys come up with on that. I think we can go another, another Valkyrie here. Let me get rid of one more of these, uh, giants here. Because I want to do this attack how I normally do. I don't normally use this many giants, so that kind of got messed up. I, I normally use, um, 20 Valkyries and I think it's 16 giants. What? I thought I got rid of enough. I need two more. So I need to get rid of these giants right here. Okay, here we go. I got three training. Um, can I get any more? No, I'm just going to train one more troop, and then we're going to start our attack. So, I don't know if this is going to work with this composition. I normally use, like I said, 16 giants and 20 Valkyries, but it should work. As far as spells go, I, I got rid of the lightning spell. I just use a jump spell now. Two free spells and two rage spells for him. Um, but the giants basically soak up all the damage from the multi-tower and frontal towers, and then my Valkyries just rip everything apart. I'm a little disappointed I didn't train up more. Don't really have the gems right now to do that either. So 13 trophies there. I kind of wanted to attack that base, but I'm looking for something with a little more trophies. Um, what's this guy got? Okay, this looks like an interesting attack. I'm not sure how this is going to go, though. I'm going to skip that. His heroes are pretty high. Um, and with the troop composition I have right now, I'm not too excited. 13 trophies, no thank you. 13 trophies, no Oh, this guy's base, though. Looks pretty funky. So, 16 trophies. This is a little bit better. I think I'm going to go ahead and attack this base. We'll have to see how it goes. Now, the thing I don't like... Okay, wait, I can lure her? Okay, I think there is like a... You can only lure her within, like, a proximity of her little base there. So, I'm just going to attack from the bottom here. And here we go. Alright, going to put in my Valkyries. Going to put in my Jump Spell, too. And my Rage Spell as well. Alright, here we go. So, everything in there is going to get ripped apart. I could have placed that Rage Spell a little bit better. A little disappointed in that. We got the, um... We got the Tesla right there. And then we got the Inferno Tower and the Expo. We're going to go ahead and take that out. I'm actually going to place down some more Giants right here. Because I want them to be able to rip through here. So, we'll take out that Inferno Tower. Watch this, guys. Those Giants are actually doing work. Look at them. And here comes our... Valkyries who are really OP. They actually redesigned them to where they position better between buildings to do more damage So I really like that about them I'm um, gonna go ahead and freeze this because I want my Giants to be able to take that out. Oh, he had a spring trap in there Doesn't look like he's gonna be able to take it out. Hopefully my king and my queen will head right towards that town hall. We're at 47% so far. Attacks are going pretty good. Oh, no, he's not gonna go for the town hall No, I forgot I used a jump spell over there. That's a little disappointing So my king and them are just going to go around us. I don't think we're going to be able to get the two star here. Unless my queen decides to do something special. Okay, I need to get my king pumped. I'm not going to let him sit there and take a bunch of damage. They also heal up now when you use their abilities, which I like a lot. It gives a lot more strategy. People are A lot of people are complaining, but I think there is a lot more str Oh, gosh. No, my queen died! She got ripped apart by the 13 king. That's ridiculous. So at 57%, I could have done this attack a little bit better. I think, um... Putting my king and queen down a little sooner. Then they would have jumped over and gone to the center there. Um, I normally wait till the end though, just to, in case. But with this attack strategy, guys, I've actually gotten a two star. And I'm not sure if I've attacked three times yet. But 
it's been working out. Um, let me show you guys this one. Oh, this one's better. I got the one star there, then the two star here. So I'll let you guys check this one out. It's a pretty good attack. This base is pretty nice too. Um, so just put the jump spell down, put in all my giants, and they're they're so tanky. They're just gonna walk in and rip everything apart. Even those Inferno Towers don't do that much damage to them. Um, put the free spell down on them. Watch those Valkyries. Boom. Just ripping everything apart. Swinging their axes. I love those things. A couple of them got taken out there. That's okay though. Our Giants are still gonna run around and do work. Those Valkyries go right in the center and they'll just rip everything apart. I put the jump spell down there mainly because I wanted to take out the Tesla ASAP. Um... I know that level 8 Tesla does quite a bit of damage, but single target, it's pretty ridiculous. So I had to take that out. Had my Giants jumping around there. And uh, we're at 34% so far. Don't know if I put my Queen down yet. I think she died. And then my Wizards over here are just going to poke down this um, Town Hall. So one Wizard and an Archer are going to take out that Town Hall for us. Pretty sweet. I thought for a second we were going to be able to get 100%. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. We weren't able to, though, because my queen was so healthy. And then I realized, oh, he's got the level 8 Teslas over here. So, got pretty disappointed there. But I think it's a great attack strategy. You know, it's pretty cheap. Um, it's like, I think, 60,000 Elixir with the 20, 20 Giants. Yeah, 60,000 Elixir with the 20 Giants. And then the Valkyries, I believe, is... Ooh, wait. How many Giants was I using? Okay, so it's 48,000 Elixir and then 3,200 Dark Elixir. So it's a little expensive with Dark Elixir, but I think this attack strategy will work in, like, higher levels, too. I mean, if you can freeze those Inferno Towers, you're pretty much good. Um, the bombs are going to do a little bit more damage, so you got to make sure you get those clear, but the Giants will pretty much do that for you. So definitely recommend that strategy. Um, it's my new favorite. I'm going to keep using it, hopefully get the champions with it. Um, level 8 Teslas, I'm going to hold off a little bit, maybe farm them. I'm actually getting a lot of gold just doing these attacks and not losing them, so I might farm those. Um, and then I also need to get the level 5 P.E.K.K.A.s, even though I'm not a fan. Not really a big deal to me. Um, I'm still going to get them just to have them. I think that's the only thing I need in my research center to get done. And uh, then we'll have everything maxed out. Oh, level 3 jump spell. Didn't realize that came 60 seconds. That's pretty crazy. Definitely going to have to look into that. Um, but yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think about this video in the comments down below. Let me know what new attack strategies you guys have been doing. And um, we need to challenge Molt. So pick a challenge, put it in the comments down below. Top comment or one I really like is going to go to Molt for the first episode of Pig. And I will see you guys later. Take it easy.